All right, that's enough. I just realized my open, my fucking window was open this entire recording. I hope to God there's no fucking like wind noise in the recording. I'm using my phone mic. Kind of, it's thematic though because it's like <laughs> Happy Wheels. It's true. We need the bad audio because it's Happy Wheels. We're 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 trying to replicate, you know, the early 2010s again. <laughs> what is your favorite movie? It's a Wonderful Life, no doubt. Okay, that's kind of gay. The fuck? Do, who, do you, who the fuck do you think you are? Okay, why don't, you pick, why don't you pick a cool movie like Fast and Furious Nine? There's not nine of those. But yeah, there is, isn't there? No, there's. Is there? I think so. Hold on, there, that can't be right. <laughs> Furiously starts that... typing. There are laws in place. Familiar. Oh, we're food. Oh, fuck. We're food. <laughs> That's my Vin Diesel impression. I watched an unhealthy amount of Tobuscus Happy Wheels when I was growing up. Oh, for sure. Tob I, I used to love Tobuscus. Um, he, he's so funny, too. I don't know if we've talked about this before, but he is one of the few YouTubers that is still very consistent. He, like still makes the same kind of content and like hasn't really changed like humor wise which is fascinating um and uh i just there's a weird prop to that and then there's also a weird like that's creepy in a way that he's just unchanged you know what i mean yeah pros very consistent with his content cons he did do a lot of drugs and potentially sexual assault but 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 the <laughs> He still does the Minecraft videos. When did he? When did he? I, uh, I feel like I'm extroverted enough that I feel like that plays in tune with me be just being like, yeah, I don't like you to somebody that I don't like at a party. If I saw Tobuscus, I would go up to him and I'd put, put my fingers through his eyes and press really hard <laughs> and then just tell him, no more redness, no more whiteness, just darkness. <laughs> you fucking couch his eyeballs out and say that. <laughs> He'd probably think it was really funny and make like a song about it. He would. He'd, he'd do a he'd do a little parody song. He'd go, Solid JJ, Solid JJ. He got out my eye. Well, you didn't survive. Who are we man. picking? Who are we picking? We're going with Pogo. Pogo? Oh, he's so fucking slow. <laughs> Good luck. Are you serious? I don't even know how you're getting in there. I'll figure it out. Yeah, so oh, I thought there would be a lot more interesting. This is an old level, but it's pr the only person you can't play as is the new helicopter guy. That's it. Why? Because he's too big to even get in this area, so you can't fucking do it. He's trying his best. Hey, the fat guy, the fat helicopter guy sucks. He's such a niche character. All the other characters are at least like somewhat doable in like multiple levels. That guy's like specifically made for like his own types of maps. You know what I mean? Like it would have to be like. Oh, something where you can pick stuff up and drop it. I don't know. It's whatever. It's a cool idea, but I, you know. And then there hasn't you been any characters since. You just described my perfect game. Uh, you're weird, and you have bad taste, and this is why everyone hates you, and everyone thinks I'm cool. No one thinks you're cool. Who? Oh yeah, because we were looking, we were googling me today, as we normally do, and the first thing that popped up was TV Filthy Frank Two Dead, and now I'm having weird anxiety about it because I'm like, who's who is consistently Googling myself dead? Me. Uh, I only ever tried cocaine once. It was at a BDSM club. I was with the YouTuber Churdleys. And uh, his friend... <laughs> actually, censor this if you're editing this. Don't don't use her name, but you can use his name. Um, uh, she, she had a fistful of cocaine, and I stuck my finger in it. I was incognito, though. I had this orange, like, ski mask on, so nobody could, like, recognize me or anything. But uh, Churdleys and all of his friends were just raw dogging it. They were just out, and people were like, "Oh my god, whoa, Churdleys is here!" <laughs> I was not about to get recognized at a BDSM club, though. I was like, "Yeah, no." So I bought the little face mask. Um, oh wait, BDSM? What? What the fuck were you doing there? Uh, they wanted to go, and I was hanging out with them that night, so that's what we did. What do you do in that? You watch people be naked and tie themselves up with rope and stuff. God damn. You need to live a little, JJ. You need to you need to get out more. I need you need to get out of there. I don't know why you <laughs> And I like even though my brother is fucking 18, like I I want to set like a good example for him. He's probably doing way worse shit than I am, but 
I, again, it's just a pride thing. I'm like, no, nah, like nobody knows that I do this kind of stuff. It's fine. So yeah, I, fucking, I didn't have a drink until college. Uh, I didn't drink until I was legal until I was 21. But even then, um, I, uh, I, I don't, I don't tell people. Ah, oh, fuck. Wait, keep going. Uh. <laughs> don't you're super, you're going pretty strong there. You got your heart, your heart was in it. <laughs> the, the, the camera's tracked to the heart, which is just a weird thing. Um. Cause that's all that really matters. And it beats too. If you look at it closely, it beats, which is gross. This game is really violent. If, if I can pause my Father's Day story <laughs> to talk about this game. This game actually this game disgusts actually, me, but I love it. Kind of I have boring. such a weird mixed like thing with it about, like, I hate how fucking gory and violent it is, but I play it constantly. Why else would you play this game? This seems like the only reason it exists. Really you know, be really, you know, make this much more, like, entertaining. How? Is if you give, like, them little voices. Oh, True! If we go, I'm the dad, and, and oh, I'm, yeah. I'm little Timmy. And, yeah. Here, we'll do that. The next one, you'll be the dad, and I'll be the kid. Okay, cool. Here, we can just do it right now. Let's do some roleplay. Watch this. I'm going to keep well, trying. Look, here's you. Here's me. What you the fuck? The you can do that? Yeah, look. Oh, son, I hate you. Get a job. Son. <laughs> he's dead, dude. He's not no, he's not. Dead. He's still alive. Here, look. Watch. Hold on. No, the it's dead. No, no, he's not. Look, look. Ah, see, he's alive. Father. <laughs> Son, where are you? Father. <laughs> Son. <laughs> Son, I'm, I'm drifting in midair. Papa. <laughs> <laughs> Son. Stop that for me. I can't. I'm... This is this, uh, I I uh, I'm on these annoying oranges. Oh my arms, fuck! Would you believe it if guys it, watching this? Would you believe it if I told you that was it? That was actually improvised. <laughs> fuck this level. What uh? What what? What's the keyword you want to look up? Annoying orange. Oh, this level. Oh, awesome. it was three a.m. and I was watching Annoying Orange, but the, he did not look normal on the screen. He looked very scary. His teeth were very realistic, and his eyes were small, sunken in. We have to look up if there's an Annoying Orange creepy pasta. That has to exist, um, right? There has to be. I mean, I can't imagine there not being like with the knife. There's probably one where it's like the knife came through the screen. It came at me. <laughs> <laughs> and he went, "Hey, Apple." And then he turns to the fucking screen and he goes, Hey, Solid JJ! And fucking, uh... <laughs> Wait a minute. That's my name. <laughs> that should be like the final TV right? Filthy Frank 2 video. It's just me watching Annoying Orange and it fucking murders me like <laughs> like this. That could be part of your retirement video. It's like, That'd guys, awesome. I've decided I'm not quitting. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna start <laughs> doing Annoying Orange reaction videos. We're gonna be rebranding. This is now. <laughs> filthy. This is annoying orange too. Fuck. This level sucks. Uh... Oh wait, oh, fuck. This is making our own level. Do you want to make your own level? No. <laughs> it's Look up Smosh. I think we need to make our own filthy Frank level and upload it. That's fucking horrible. Let's do it. Smosh. Smosh has to come up with like a whole bunch of them. There That's we go. A lot. Smosh quiz. So let's test our Smosh like knowledge. Yes. Who are the creators of Smosh? Uh, Anthony Patia. I mean, uh, uh, left one. This one. Yeah. 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 That was easy. In two thousand two, what did Smosh say was the number one thing to do with duct tape? Two thousand two. Joe. Jesus Christ. These are essays. Walk up to a hot girl with a roll of duct tape and can ask with whipped cream and ask him if they want to do something while winking at them. Tape up your friends so they cannot move and offer to sell them for sex so they walk by. See how many feet of tape you can shove down their throat without them dying. I'm gonna say this one. Were these that? So wait, so one of these is... Oh, wow. What? Hey, I know my stuff. How many channels do they have? Uh... No, we, we, we can't just go pat beyond that. What The full thing was tape people up and sell them for sex? Yeah, that seems up their alley. What do you mean? What do you mean that was up their I I, I, knew, I remember they did Boxman and like, like food fights. Yeah, and, and, you know, they'd have edgy little jokes, like selling people for sex, whatever. Smosh oh, versus PewDiePie. This one has to be good. Who are we picking? No, we're going with Pogo. 
Okay. No! You always fucking pick Pogo. Pogo, dude. We're doing Santa. Uh, b bullshit. Yeah, see, this is what you get. <laughs> Ian's mom, Anthony, and Ian. Why is it Ian's mom? <laughs> Ian's mom, mom. Ian's oh mom is awesome. Why is she fat? I killed Ian, dude. Wait, fuck, hold on. Wait, I'm bad He's at wasted half her swords. They, they, ugh, fuck. They didn't do the thing where they put a bar halfway between you, so you fucking, like, stay still. Oh, right in his ass. Hold on, hold on. I got this. Yeah! Ah, oh, fuck! Um, little, little do people know about the, uh, the irresponsible dad, uh, floating mechanic, where if you get a little bit of air and then you hit the sidebars really fast, you can kind of... Well, that's what you get. Been, uh, I, there's a Weird Al song about Ground Zero, and I used to sing it without knowing what the fuck it was, and my parents were like, dude, don't sing that. And uh, I remember out. I was at the park once, and I was on the swings, and I was with this other kid on the swings. I had no idea who this kid was, right? And I was like, do you know what Ground Zero is? And my mom just looked at me and shook her head and go, don't. <laughs> All I'm going to say is that, that I remember seeing the that. that immediately after 9-11... Uh, Weird Al Yankovic was seen being pulled into a, a black car and brought to the White House and then dropped off soon after. I don't know what kind of conversation they had. It was really weird, too, because after that, his look was completely different. He used to have short curly hair and, like, glasses and a mustache. And then after, he had no glasses, long hair, and no mustache. <laughs> he walked in with the curly hair, glasses, mustache. He walked out. His skin was, like... Yellow. He, he was bald. His eyes were like. It was gaunt. Yeah, he looked like a husk. He looked like a hollowed out man. This is what I would do to you if. <laughs> oh if my I god! Saw you. Just gonna, I'm just gonna let this game in there, dude. That's how they actually did it. That's how they do it all the ISIS videos. Yeah, that's how they, they. That's how they do the beheadings. It's awesome. Destroy just... ISIS and get revenge. Yeah. What the fuck? What if this was like? What if like this kid lost his parent to an ISIS beheading, and this is like his way of coping with it? <laughs> so he made the level. He was like, I have to get revenge for them. Uh, oh, shit. Whoa, holy fuck. This is, the, this is actually the this is actually the level that the U.S. Army made for soldiers getting prepared to go. <laughs> to promote them going out to war and shooting ISIS members in the face. <laughs> Whoa, what the? This is, it was nothing like the simulations. This is so... Different. Ah, they're they're all on their little bikes with kids strapped to the back. <laughs> they all get deployed. They're on pogos and fucking yeah, that's <laughs> mining <awesome>. here. <laughs> that's great. Obama, Obama's like sending the drones, and it's that guy in the helicopter. <laughs> oh shit! Twin tower jump, pogo. No, it's a jump. Wait, what? Is, how is this nine eleven? <laughs> How is this 9-11? Why did that make me laugh? <laughs> Why is it 9-11? Why is there only one black man and nothing else? I love how the level starts. It's almost like he was about to jump off, but then he's like, he chooses life. And he sits down, he's like, thank you for talking me out of it. And then, and then this happens. <laughs> and then you just kill me. <laughs> thank, you, thank you for talking me out of it. And then immediately hit him with a fucking like helicopter blade. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> the way he said that dude, was so on. fucking funny. Thank you for it's talking like, me out. <laughs> That's this big black guy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's. 9 11 tribute. Tribute in parentheses. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> this is so fucking horrible. This Wait, is a I tribute. Died, this is a tribute. In memory of those who lost their lives on 9 11. And they're all blowing up and fucking dying. Wait, wait, we have to try to get try to get a time of 9-11. Oh my god, okay, here, hold on, let's see, uh... Oh, fuck oh my god! god. <laughs> <laughs> Thought I actually had a plane in it. Oh my god. I'll take that dinner to go. <laughs> Check, please. <laughs> this was a sad day in America. Sad day in America's history. 9-11 quiz? Okay, we'll do the 9-11 quiz, and I think we're done with 9-11 levels. Welcome, Welcome to my 9-11 quiz. quiz. I'm sorry for all the people who died. What was 9 <laughs> What was 9-11? Uh, August? <laughs> I can't even break these. What the fuck? There we go. Alright. Ah, my leg. How many, How many people, people died, died in 9-11? My wish I is wish to all that died! <laughs> oh my. How many, 
It's one off. It's way I mean, uh. Nine eleven. No, okay, last one. Nine eleven. No. After this is. The oh last my one. god. <sighs> you are the evil. I have no words for this one. You do nine eleven. Uh, the one below is I want to I want to know about. 9-11 Revenge. 9-11 Revenge. And you play as the black kill guy. All kill night. all night. Kill all night. <laughs> oh, you read it, goddamn. No, no, go ahead, go ahead. No, we don't want to read it. No, you can read it. Uh, fuck you, anyways. Kill all 19 hijackers and the leader in this fantastic revenge. You son of a bitch. <laughs> that's what you did to me in the Pokemon video. I didn't even understand that that's what you are doing. The, oh my god, you got the names of all the fucking hijackers! Muhammad Ada. Oh, oh my god, no, these are, wait, these are real. These are wow. their actual names. That's insane. And you can slurp them up with your lawnmower, which is the cool little feature that the lawnmower does. I never realized you could do that. What? That's the best part of the lawnmower guy. Are you serious? I didn't know, like, you absorbed it. I just thought you, like, shredded it. No, yeah, you suck up the little body parts. It's cool. I like how we're more, we're more interested in the mechanics of the lawnmower than the fact that you're running over the actual 9-11 <laughs> conspirators. Hey, and we know how many there are. There's 19, which we learned from the quiz we took. Isn't that uh, awesome? Write this down. We can use this on the quiz. <laughs> Rip 9-11. Fuck you, Al-Qaeda. F you, Al-Qaeda. It's not even fuck This you. was actually, this is the reason we were able to find the Osama who was playing this. That's and he awesome. released an angry, he released an angry Let's Play about it, Rage. Like a Rage video where he's like screaming in the corner. And the, they were able to like use the background of his camera to find out where he was <laughs> twice at a store i found dvds that have been completely stacked up then i saw an annoying orange dvd when i got back home at 5 45 i popped the dvd in and i saw in bold text annoying or uh, orange gets me trouble <laughs> it says orange i was a bit confused the episode <laughs> started with a shot of the microwave in the kitchen there was a huge hole in it, and thick yellow glass was pouring <laughs> from it. <laughs> Gas, sorry. <laughs> Pear tells Orange that he blew a hole in the microwave while it was on. Orange did not seem to care, and he said, Aw, Pear, don't get all cooked up about it. And then laughed. <laughs> Things were beginning to get creepy. <laughs> <laughs> if they haven't already. <laughs> Things were beginning to get creepy as everyone was looking at Orange, horrified. Orange, said Pear, in 24 hours our peers will disintegrate our eyeballs will melt and will die from the radiation. <laughs> if you want to annoy us, do it, do it now while it lasts. What? What do you mean? Said Orange. We can't die. I have golden kazoos to play. I have TNT to explode. Sorry, Orange, said Grapefruit. But in 24 hours, we'll all die. Nice! Yelled Orange. <laughs> a hand holding a knife came down and cut Grapefruit in half. Whoa, Orange, said Pear. What was that for? What was that for? I'll show you. <laughs> what? I'll show you all what fucking dying is, said Orange. <laughs> He didn't sound like himself here. His he voice like sounded himself, like Chris. demonic voice. He didn't sound like himself when he said, I'll show you all what fucking die. <laughs> nice. He yelled again, causing Grandpa Lemon to get ah! He yelled, Nice. Again, and Mitchin Mitchin Apple was killed too. Orange, are you okay? Said Passion Fruit. Yeah, said Orange. I love you. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! He screamed. Pear looked around at the corpses of his dead friends and said, "Love." <laughs> Passion fruit, marshmallow, orange, and pear survived. <laughs> it's just that one sentence. <laughs> the last scene showed N Nerva was crying and loves passion. Wait, that's Tabasco. The last scene showed Nerva was crying and loves passion fruit, marshmallow, orange, and pear, and splattering them on a wall. They spelled out the end. <laughs> the people who made the episode were later sentenced to life in prison. <laughs> <laughs> the TV two and missing our sentence. In 2014, Danbo found the DVD and uploaded it on YouTube. It was taken down in 2016. It was up there a whole two years. 
There are 11 copies of the DVDs. If you find one, upload it and explain this episode on YouTube immediately. This is a real thing. Oh my god. I don't I don't even think I'm going to be sleeping tonight.